David Cohen from Variety here. We're backstage at Fox NFL Sunday. If you've ever looked at this show's hosts and reporters and thought, those guys look spiffy, they must take great care of themselves, and boy, do they know how to dress. Well, not exactly. My name is Lisa Ashley. I am the department head for hair and makeup. With the guys, you try to keep them as natural as possible. I like to make them look like they've been, maybe been in the sun for a day. Oh, she's a genius. I do mixed martial arts and I come in and I'll have like a cut here, bruises here, something nicked up here. You would never tell that I'm a crappy fighter, right? By being on TV because she covers up all the bruises, but I am a crappy fighter. This room in here is so lively at 5.30 in the morning on Sunday morning. So everybody comes in, it seems like everybody likes to hang out in this room. You know, we tell a lot of jokes, we sing some songs, you know. They ask us how our weekend is or our week has been. Terry likes a lot of loving, so he always makes sure to come in in the middle of the afternoon to get his little neck rubbed on, his hands worked on with some lotion. It's a perfect opportunity for me to touch him up. You know, I always have to fix his hair. So as soon as I touch his hair, he leans his head back, and that's the sign for me to rub his back. Because he's old and he's been here longer than everybody else, so Kit, Terry gets his neck rubbed, he gets, and every once in a while, by default, I may get a little treatment like that if the girls feel sorry for me. For years, I'm the, uh, I'm kind of the chosen one here. <laughs> they, all the girls like to spoil me. They think I'm like a teddy bear. We do call you Tear Bear. He's, he's my guinea pig. Watch, this is what? what we love to do. Right over his makeup. Oh, this stuff, this is nice. It's a moisturizer. I use it on my, on my scaly hands and arms. It gets here at 3 a.m. You know, when you look that way pre-makeup, it's a three, four hour process. It's a lot like doing, I would imagine, Avatar. You know, it's that kind of makeup. Thank you, Terry. Really beautiful. Thank you, lady. We love you. I am the lucky one who gets to dress these beautiful men. I literally get to start from a swatch of fabric because everything is custom made for them. Each guy definitely has, you know, has their own personality and I try to reflect that in what they wear. Terry obviously is a little more fun so I can do bright, fun colors with him. And Michael and Howie are definitely my fashion plates. I mean, people talk to me and they don't even say, oh, I really like your ruling about that incomplete past. They say, you looked great. You do spectacular things with pocket squares. Thank you. I, it's my passion. I, I mean, I love men's clothing, and it's really a, an art form in itself. Have you learned about how to dress from working with Vicky? No, I'm clueless with it. I, I, sometimes I'll tell her, I'll pick something out, I'll be like, hey, this looks great, right? And she'll be like, not at all. Doesn't look good at all. I'm like, really? She's like, no. I mean, you know what? I'm really blessed in the fact that they truly trust me. And I'm, I mean, I put an outfit in their room, and they wear it. The ladies back there are like the mothers and sisters and daughters, depending on which one of the guys on the set you talk to. There's nothing that happens in any of our lives that we don't share it with one another. We're all, we're all sounding boards. When you've mm -hmm. been together this long, you have such a great trusting friendship. I mean, I brought all of my personal issues in this door. It's a great team. I mean, it's a great family. We're just really lucky to have each other, and it's a great support system that we have for, um, with one another. 